Hey guys, it's the Real China Sister. I'm back with another video. I know it's been mad long since I released a video. I've been super busy with so many things in my life. Um, last time you guys checked in, I was looking at furniture for my new apartment that I recently got. Um, today, I'm actually going to be doing a crate and barrel unboxing slash haul type of video. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys some of the pieces that I got for my new place from Crate and Barrel. I really like Crate and Barrel stuff. I feel like their stuff is like so refined and so nice and so classy. And that's kind of like the theme I wanted in my new place. You know, your girl is grown, you know, getting into it. You know, I'm super excited about this new place. So I really wanted to dress it up. I really wanted to make it like grown and sophisticated and like modern. So today I'm gonna be showing you and opening up like some of the packages. I have like a whole stack of packages here i'm gonna open them up and just show you guys some of the stuff that i got from crate and barrel this is just so you guys can get like a better look at the boxes a lot of boxes to open up today i'm gonna start with this little one yeah i'm gonna be opening some boxes so like quick story time this is the strawberry um dragon fruit refreshing drink from dunkin donuts i like got uber eats to like bring over um a drink for me or whatever and they didn't give me a freaking straw like the drink is good i just wish they would have gave me a straw i don't like drinking out of cups like that if i can use a straw but yes let's get into this video i'm sorry about like any background noise you might hear um that's like people or workers outside i don't know so first i'm gonna open this little package I don't remember what's in each package because I bought a lot of stuff and I just I don't remember so I'm gonna be opening it for you guys firsthand to see what your girl got um, oh it's my electric can opener it's a Cuisinart it's really nice my mom always told me Cuisinart has really nice products so it was like a lot of my stuff is Cuisinart. This is it. I'm going to take it out of the box so you guys can see it. I don't know if you need to. You guys want to look down and watch me open it. It's very nice. Oh, I like it. This is it. It is so nice. I gotta figure out how I'm gonna like display everything in the kitchen and everything. Or what I'm gonna like put away and what I'm gonna keep out. This is really nice. Here's the plug. It's really nice. To the side for a bit so that I can open up the next thing for you guys to see. Some of this tape they use is like really tough. The receipt. Oh, look. They give crate and barrel wrapping paper. That's so cute. I don't know what this is. It's wine openers I got. Aren't they so nice? They're like crate and barrel signature. They're really nice. Moving on to the next box. Oh, this actually goes to something. I have a wine bucket type thing for like when I'm entertaining or I have friends over or something and this actually goes with it. There's like an ice scooper. Very nice. This box is a little bigger. Let's see how that goes. And for anybody wondering like why I'm cutting these boxes open with one of my butter knives, um, I packed my scissors and I don't remember where they are, so don't judge me. I'm getting the job done. That's all that matters. So this is... Oh, a blender. Blenders. I knew that I wanted a blender, like, for my place or whatever, because, like, who doesn't have a blender? You know, a lot of my friends wanted me to, like, do... They're like, oh, you should do a housewarming, or oh, you should do a um, gift registry. That's what it is. And, I mean... I guess I'm not really into that. This is kind of like why I wasn't saying, oh yeah, I'll do that. Cause like I already had everything that I really want and things that I like. So, you know, I don't know. But this is like everything that I wanted. This 
this kitchen is like becoming a mess now on the floor. Oh look, they gave me a Crate and Barrel magazine. Let me see, put that there. This is, okay, there's a few things in here. Let me unwrap this. Let me see. This is something fragile because it has like the bubble wrap on it in the inside. Oh, these are wine glasses. Very nice. Let me see. I'll take these out for you guys to like see. It's the same. It's two of them that I got. Oh, isn't that nice? I like this. I need to figure out where I'm going to put them. So there's two of them I have here. Very nice. i put it somewhere nicely because it's glass. I really don't want to break anything. So then here, what is this? Okay, hold on. Oh, this goes with, okay, so like with my ice bucket and the ice scooper that I showed you guys, I have like a whole set of things. I think this is used to mix drinks. There's a spoon. Oh, here it goes. There's a spoon in here. And you like use this to like, I guess, mix, mix drinks and stuff. I also got this for like when I entertain. I like to be very like color coordinated and have everything nice. All the items that go together for like when I have people over. I just like for things to look nice and have good presentation. So that's why I got that. Um, well, I think these are like little, I think there's another these are like little shot glasses again for like if I have friends over you know I just I like nice things I like for everyone to have something nice so I have four of these yeah there's two more over here that's all that was in this box but yeah just so you guys can get a look at all four of them very pretty and this is the mixer thing again in the spoon I had to figure out like where I'm going to put it or how I'm going to set it up. So yeah, we're moving on to another box. I'm just going to put this in here for now so that it's like not in the way. Wow. Do this. Just so it's out of the way. It's not going to go there. I just don't want it in the way of what I'm doing. So this is another box of stuff. I'm tossing things to the side, but of course, like I'm gonna clean up afterwards. Let's steal straws that I wanted. I just want to try them out since I see a lot of YouTubers talk about like how great they are. Uh, this is a ice cream scooper. This is an ice cream scooper. Really nice and thick. I like it. There's actually a box in here. I don't remember, again, I don't remember what's in each box. There's nothing else in here. Um, let me see, where's my name? Oh, this is the, okay, so this is the original um, ice bucket I had got. Again, um, I have one that's nicer than this that I ordered, but I'll just keep it just because, because it's nice. I mean, it's nice. It's um, it's glass. It's nice. It's just, I like the other one that I got from Crate and Barrel. It's somewhere in here. I could use one of my stainless steel straws, but I really don't want to. Or you know what? I'll try it like on camera. It'll be like a mini stainless steel straw review. First, I got to get this lid back on. I'm struggling. Oh, you know what? I'll do it from this side. So I'm going to open up this. Oh, look, it comes with a cleaner. Like a little brush, I guess, for when you're cleaning it. That's cute. I was like, oh, I don't want to use one of my nice straws, but I have to wash it. So. So refined. So delish. 
<laughs> but yeah, back to the unboxing. Here's another box. Another one. Another Crate and Barrel magazine. I have like a lot of them, I'm sure. Like, let me see. Let's go back there. Let's see what's in. Okay, there's a few items in this box. Oh, there's some more. Hold on. This is some more wine glasses. Four rosé wine glasses. Very nice. They're like pink and pretty. I'll put some Pepsi in them. They're so cute. I think this is so cute. Like for girls or like women to have in their place. Especially like when they live by themselves. and Or you have like a roommate of girls. Like that's cute. You guys have girls night and everyone drinks their rosé wine glasses. Okay, there's a box down here and it's heavy. Okay, okay. There we go. I think there's something else in that box. Oh, oh, these are glasses I have got. I can't, I don't wanna, if you guys can. These are glasses I got. Like they're okay, but now I kind of don't know how I feel about them. And there's like one, two, three, one, two, three, four, twelve of them. Like they're okay. I'll keep them around for just in case reasons, but I'm not like, I don't know. Maybe they look prettier like online to me. They're okay. I'm not gonna toss them, but do they really need to be here? Who knows? Um what is this? Oh, this looks like another type of wine opener I got. God, I got you know, some stuff that I buy, I don't always like remember. Because I'll just see something and be like, oh, that's pretty. And I'll get it. This is nice, though. Isn't that nice? This is nice. I like this. My crate and barrel. Unboxing. So, there's this one. And... I think, yeah. Oh, this is, okay, so this is the, let me see what are these. Oh, these are, I got these 50 crate and barrel candles. I like candles. For anyone that doesn't know, I really like candles. And I thought these were like so cute. There's 50 of them in here. They're really nice. And then, okay, I got these cute little ice trays because I thought they were really cute. They're gray and I feel like they make cute little ice cubes for like drinks and stuff. Like clearly I can go and buy like ice if I want to, but I think it's cute. The ice tray thing is cute. Look, oh, here's my other set of stainless steel straws that I got. I got, so I have eight of them. This is for like cake. This is like the cake knife and the cake server. There's a knife and here's a server. Like I said, I like to have pieces to everything so that I can never, oh, I wish I had this or I wish I had that. I just like to have every piece of everything. Okay, there's another box in here, but it's really heavy. So I'm gonna try and keep it in there, but I'm gonna open so I can see what it is. I think this is the ice bucket that I said is nicer to me than the other one. Hold on. The ice bucket that I said is nicer. Yeah. This is the other ice bucket. So you guys tell me what you think. I think this one is nicer than the... Oh, wait, no. This is the ice bucket. This is, um, this is for cake. <laughs> this is the, you know, the top and bottom. So I do like to bake. I like to make, like, red velvet cake and stuff from time to time. And I got a thing for when I make a cake so it can 
sit properly where it belongs. I'm trying to get it out so I can show you guys. This is the top that goes. And then this is the bottom. I know I'm making a mess, but I'm going to clean it up. It really doesn't matter. This is the bottom. So isn't that nice? Very nice. This is how it'll sit on the counter. So you guys can like, let me move my neck. So you guys can see. It's so nice. I like it. This is so nice. I have to find a good place for this because I don't want to break it. Hell, hold on. Okay. This better be my square plates. Because I know I ordered square plates from Crate and Barrel. Yeah, these are them. I got the square plates more so for like a nice dinner or if I make a nice dinner and have company or something like that. Because that's what I like always saw. These are like the dinner plates. And then I have like the So I'm going to unravel these so you guys can see like what they look like. It's a lot of they like really wrap them so they don't damage. I'm sorry if I'm giving like any viewer like nervous the way I unwrap things or undo things. Very heavy handed and rough. Like that's just how I am. So this is the dinner plate. Isn't that nice? I think they're so pretty. I have a few of them. Um, that That's what the dinner plates look like. And... And here wrapped up, I believe, is the appetizer plate. Or like a dessert. Like if I made cake or something, I would probably put them like on this. I don't see how to... Let me just move this out the way. So you guys can see the appetizer plate. They're really cute. You know, the appetizer, or I might put like a slice of cake or something on it. It's so cute. See inside the thing, I know you guys can't see it. It says small bites are the best bites. If you guys can see it. That's so cute. So, in this box, let me see. Oh, this is my toaster. I believe this is Cuisinart as well. Yep. It is. Um, you guys see it good? Four waffles at one time if I want them to eat. I like waffles. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just put it up. Isn't this nice? It's so nice. I love it. I can't wait to make waffles in here. Here's the toaster. It's so nice. So shiny. I can't wait to make waffles in it. Isn't it so nice? It says Cuisinart. It. It's so nice. I of this crate and barrel box. It says ice bucket on it champagne ice bucket so this is the one that i thought looked better than the other one you guys tell me what you think remember the other one was like glass this one is like i believe like a silver like tub yeah i'm a little rough sometimes don't fault me for that so this is what it looks like it's huge you put a whole bunch of ice yeah, it's like a silver ice bucket. Very nice. Huge. I like it. I can't wait to like have people over and like use it. I wanted to try an air fryer like every other person I see in the rest of the world. And I thought this air fryer from Crate and Barrel was so nice. Of course it's Cuisinart. But the shit is like 
big as a freaking stove. I wanted like a cute air fryer that I could like sit on the countertop, but this shit is big as hell. I didn't realize it was so big. Like maybe that's my fault for like not reading dimensions and stuff like that. But from the picture, it looks so cute and dainty. Like something like I could work with. Cause I'm not always the best with electronics. But this shit is big as hell. So, oh wait, is this it? Yeah. I think it's big, like I've seen smaller, I've seen people with smaller air fryers that are like regular size. It's very nice, don't get me wrong. It's just huge. So this is it, you guys. This is the Cuisinart air fryer, best way to fry. This is exactly what it looks like. But again, I just feel like it's huge. Like, I don't know. It's not bad. It's not bad, I guess. Do you guys think it's like not that big? That's the back of it, just the front of it. So if you guys can see it, you can move some of this stuff out of the way. I might do like a cook with me or something. Some kind of like cook with me so that you guys can watch me attempt to use an air fryer. I'm sure you'll laugh at me. I laugh at myself all the time because I'm not the most great when it comes to electronics like this. But yeah, this is really nice actually. Can this... Yeah, I don't want to break anything. This is the shit I'm talking about with me and you know, like, like I'm, I'm always struggle. Ooh, this looks like the Easy Bake Oven I had when I was little. I had like a Barbie Easy Bake Oven. Yeah, I don't want to break anything because I'm heavy handed, but this is basically the air fryer. It's so cute. So it's, it's not what I thought it was. I thought it was like big like a fucking house or something, but it's actually really good. I can't wait to cook things or make things in here the only thing i'm not looking forward to is cleaning it like i wasn't really thinking about that part where it's like oh people like clean it and stuff if anybody knows an easy way to clean an air fryer please let me know about it i would love to know or do i have to like do it like myself but yes that's my crate and barrel unboxing for you guys again i'm sorry that i have been gone for so long but i had to get some things together and now everything is together and your girl is back better than ever doing the damn thing so if you guys have gotten this far in the video have not got a chance yet make sure you hit that subscribe button i'll be posting a video every day this week i'm actually going to be posting my bed bath and beyond unboxing because i actually have some items from bed bath and beyond as well um comment below and tell me what you guys think of some of the items that i got from my apartment comment below and let me know if there's anything you guys think i should be getting from my apartment that i haven't gotten already see you guys soon